Hello everybody, welcome to the show. This is Andre J. McClendon. This video is going to be about support and resistance. So let's get right into it. All right, guys, so we are on the one minute on the euro dollar. Now we are panned in, we're zoomed into the fastest time frame. So one minute means every single little candlestick's one minute. But since we're measuring support and resistance, we're going to show you, I'm going to show you why it matters what's the type of what support and resistance are you at. So right now, a support and resistance can be measured like this. So if you look at a house, this resistance level or this roof, every time price or these candlesticks hit this price, it bounces and respects this price level. So it's like a roof. Now support, kind of like the floor, when it hits this price location, it respects it this price and then bounces off kind of like bouncing a ball on the floor see bounces bounces that's what we call support is the floor resistance is the roof and it continuously does this uh, these there's different types of support resistances but for these are just horizontal ones see how it hits this support bounces hits this resistance level and it breaks through or continues so these are some of the basics when it comes to support and resistance on the one minute but well, we're going to kick it to a higher time frame. Let's go to five minutes and see how the same thing plays out. So now each little candlestick is five minutes. Five minutes, five minutes, five minutes. And you can tell on this live chart for Euro dollar in the five minute, it broke through this resistance level. Now I can respect it and head back lower or it can keep on continuing. But we're going to start measuring out a little bit more. Okay. So where else can we find support? Right here, support. But now, if you start looking at some of the uh, support resistance levels, this support, it broke through, bounced off this support level, and now the support became resistance for this way up. Now, when it comes to it coming up to this price point from here, respecting this support level here, it goes right back up to here. And now that, this level, becomes uh, resistance. And then if this continues through and builds up more, this can become resistance and also support. But all right, guys, that's it for the free portion. If you guys want to find out more about the trading courses and learn more about stocks and Forex, please go to my website. But for people who are paid subscribers, go to part two and uh, enjoy.